there have been concerns about Deutsche Bank, Deutsche Bank management. There was also profit warning, and of course, the fig, the trading arm, uh, lost Thursday. How much do we believe this report? I mean, we, we uh, first of all, they didn't name sources. We're doing our own digging around. But is John Cryan really close to being replaced? I don't think this should come as any surprise. I mean, we've seen murmurings last year even uh, of dissatisfaction with John Cryan. Um, and if you just look at the share price, I think it's down over 25% this year, um, whereas the rest of the European banks um, are, are sort of flattish sort of over the last year or so. Um, so clearly there's dissatisfaction with the share price performance. Uh, and in terms of John Cryan specifically, I think there are very legitimate questions to be asked about strategic U-turns. Um, shortly after he came in, um, he decided to separate the global markets and the corporate bank. And then the best part of a year later, he put them back together. Um, also his communication style, um, he comes across as being quite dour, quite sober. Um, and there some bankers have questioned whether that's good for morale. Uh, and then finally, also his slow progress on costs. Um, yeah, but Arjun, I mean, morale, it's like if they're too loud, it's oh, they're too loud. If, if they're too downbeat, oh, they're, they're, they're not, you know, they're not boosting morale. Like, is there a, a person that the shareholders would be happy with or do they just want a higher <coughs> share price? I, think, I mean, it's clearly the latter, but I think in terms of how do we get there, um, I think that's a very fair question. I think um, it, we shouldn't underestimate the size of the restructuring task at Deutsche Bank. I think it's clear that there is going to be no quick fix and that um, you, you remember when John Cryan came in, he was, he was widely um, welcomed and acknowledged as uh, very respected in the industry. <clears throat> so it's not clear or it's not certain that a new... Uh, CEO will automatically right. fix all of Deutsche Bank's problems. Bring up a chart here. Arjun, I was surprised. I had forgotten how John Cryan's only been around for two cups of coffee. J.P. Morgan in white, Barclays in blue, Fortress Staley, and the Deutsche Bank lagging in yellow. And Arjun, Mr. Cryan shows up in July of 2015. To be clear here, this was a grievously troubled bank when he walked in the door, right? Absolutely. And, you know, there were question marks over this legal risk overhanging the bank. Um, they've settled that uh, with the, the Department of Justice in, in the U.S. Um, there were also question, big question marks over the capital position. They're now comfortably well capitalized. They've got a capital ratio of 14 um, percent. That's, right. you know, among the highest in, 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 the, Europe, in the European area. So it, it's really now a question of profitability. And, and that's where they're sort of stumbling well, at this point in time.